deals with magnetism. What change in magnetic properties, if any, uh, can be expected when NL2-1- ligands in an octahedral field are replaced by chloride ligands in a D6 complex? Okay, so when we look up the spectrochemical series, uh, we see that the NL2-1- ligand is going to be a stronger uh, field ligand than Cl1-. So this is going to give us a larger delta O. This is going to give us the smaller delta O. And remember, okay, large delta O means it's going to be a low spin, and small delta O means it's going to be high spin. So let's go ahead and draw the possibilities out. So D6 low spin means that all of my electrons are paired. And so that's going to be diamagnetic. And here we have D6 high spin. And all of a sudden we get uh, at least one unpaired electron. And that's going to be paramagnetic. And so to answer this question, when you replace the NO2, one minus ligands with the chloride ligands, you go from a compound that's diamagnetic to one that exhibits paramagnetism. All right, so that's our lecture today on the transition elements. I want to thank you for your time, and I'll see you next time on educator.com.